Good afternoon everyone, it is April 6, 2015, episode 1, my first real day this spring out on the allotment and I'm going to go out and grow some onions from the greenhouse into the ground and then when I, I will then put in more into the greenhouse and we'll do it another day. So it's onions for this to start and we'll take it from there. Their first, their first onions I'm putting in uh, to the ground, I've made holes about six or seven inches apart and the first one is called Red Baron, so it's a red onion, we take the seed, you can see it just like that, with nice roots on it, and then go straight into the ground, in like that, the way he is. That's Red Baron, lovely looking roots on him there. He goes straight into the ground, roots down, and we put him about the same way as he was. So there we go. A good start for the Red Baron. Okay, I'll, I'll finish off those and show you, show you more. So I have put in one tray of Red Baron in here, and I have another tray to go in here. So they're the red barrels, that's the way I got them out of the greenhouse. And good nice big roots on the bottom of them, but they wouldn't last in many more days. So we get those in without further ado. So, tray number two. Uh, now this is the way I do it. Uh, the, the roots are on the bottom already. So all I have to do is to loosen out this, put them in, and put them in exactly the way they were. Same room, same thing. Sometimes I have to widen it with my special <laughs> widening stick, like that. And then nice roots there, in they go. I do one or two more for you. So you have to do it. There you go. Next one. Lovely roots on that. Look at that. Good start to have. There we go. In they go. So, I'm going to finish these off and then sh and finally uh, show you so I have golden gourmet and shallots to put in. So only about 12 of the golden gourmet because I really don't need a lot of onions because they're so cheap in the shops. But I love fresh shallots and I have another tray of shallots to go in as well. So we'll get on with those. So I make the holes for the shallots. I make five and then six and then I make five again. I hope you can see it. Three, four, five, and one there, six, this one. So it's five and six, eleven each time. So there we go. Uh, we get the shallots. And nice juicy big fat ones they are too. Look at that. I have to make the hole bigger for this. And the big juicy fat. Yeah. Oh yes, that's nice. That's one. Take another big one beside it. Now let's put it in the video. Yeah. Better hold. Nice roots on the shallot, it gives them a good head start. So there we go, I have another uh, maybe two rows. Okay, I'll finish this out shallot and I'll take it from there. I am now going to uh, put a tunnel. It's a very simple little one. one. It goes like this. Connector. And you put another in here. And you bring it across. Like that. And down it goes in there. Same height as that one. And I continue doing another one here. So here's the tunnel. Um. Well, that's the end of my first spring day on the, uh, on the plot. I've got onions in and I have a tunnel put in. And